Hey Wax Friends, Maggie here. Welcome back to my channel. I have so many deliveries and so many videos to do. I've just got a mess around this office. You can't see it, but all around me here on the floor, I have a huge haul from Ebony and Ivory. I have my Rose Girls and I have a ginormous Scentsy haul. And uh, I have so much Scentsy coming in from the darn warehouse sale. I've run out of room. I I don't know what I'm going to do with all my Scentsy. I've, I've got to, I've got to get my shit together. I really do, guys. I am out of control. And I don't know what I'm going to do with it. But this video is a Rose Girls haul video. I'm not going to dwell on my lack of space and organization for my wax anymore. Because what I have here is a really, really good order. I'm so excited about it. Just got it in the mail today. This was the RTS that she just had. Uh, incredibly fast shipping. I still have a pre-order out with her. And I'm really excited about that pre-order also. So, let's get started. Now, in this RTS, she had a lot of single scents, which I was excited about. I did get busy. I don't remember what was going on, but I got busy. I forgot. I don't know. And I didn't get a couple of them that I wanted. I know I wanted, was it apple fritters? I think I, she had that one I wanted. I wanted lemonade and I wanted, was it a dunk my donut? Did she have that by her itself maybe? And I wasn't able to get that, but I got a lot of other good stuff. So she had some pre-order was it pre-order leftovers maybe? And then some of all, all these single sets. So the first one I got, Cola. These are six, supposed to be six ounce bags, um, $9. Um, this is, I've never had her Cola by itself. And it is a strong Cola. It reminds me of those Cola gummy candies. My kids were all in German club in high school and that brand of candy, what is it called? Now I'm going to draw a blank. Harbiso or Har? It starts with an H, I think. Well, it's a German brand. So every year that was their fundraiser and they sold, they were a little bit bigger than what you can get in the store for two bucks and the cola bottles, cola fizzy bottles were, were one of the ones that they sold. And yeah, that's exactly what this reminds me of. This is good. This will be good mixed with about anything. Harbiso, is that what that brand was? I don't know. Then I grabbed Orange Sherbert. Now, I have fallen in love with Scentsy's Rainbow Sherbert, so I'm wanting to dabble in some other Sherberts. And this is good. I mean, yeah, this is really good. It's just a really sweet orange, effervescent-y kind of, kind of scent. That'll be good mixed with about anything also. Okay, what else we got here? Berry Cream Brulee. Ooh, this is really good. Oh yeah, this would be good with any kind of bakery. Just a, it's almost ras, raspberry. I'm wondering if it's like a raspberry, blueberry type mix. Yeah, that is really, really good, guys. I like this one. Like, like, like. Ooey gooey caramel. I do like caramel and wax. I like it mixed with coffee a lot. Oh yeah, now I get more. Yeah, this is just a nice caramel. I mean, it's it's caramel. I don't notice, I'm not good I guess with that. I don't notice a lot of difference in caramels. I don't know, does anybody, is there a difference? I don't really know, it smells like caramel. I like it. Uh, raspberry sauce, this is one I went in for. Oh, 
I do like this. This is, this is body care-esque, right? I mean, I really, really like this, but it's not, I don't, I get like a perfuminess to this. And I know Raspberry Pulse perfume, you know, body care a lot. This is really, really pretty. I was thinking I was going to be mixing this with, with bakery, but I don't know. That's beautiful. That is really, really nice. I do like that. Not really what I was expecting, but that's okay. Florida Key Lime Pie. I am becoming a Key Lime Pie fan. Okay. 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 So I... I think, I think I figured it out. I think I like lime because I like more tart, um, not sour, but you know, stronger lime, key limes. To me, this is creamy. I get the pie. I get the bakery in this. And that's not bad. I think there are two kinds of key lime pie people, right? Um, one that likes the creamy bakery key lime pie and the one that likes the loud in your face tart lime. I'm the lime. But this is nice. This is pretty. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with this. To me, I just think it's a softer lime. That's all good. Then I grab vanilla chai. I am really liking chai and wax and um, kind of gingerbread and chai type scents. Ooh, I like this. Okay, this would be really good with coffee, I think. Oh yeah. I almost get a, well, it, no, it, it smells like chai, it does. It's like maybe clove, cinnamon, that sort of thing. Oh, this is fantastic. Yeah, I really, really like the vanilla chai. I will probably mix this with coffee. Then I'll try to stick with all of the single scents or uh, coconut cherry margarita. Okay, this is a stretch for me. I am loving cherry and wax. So I'm getting the cherry. That's first and foremost, of course. It usually is. I don't know if I'm getting coconut, but I do get, I think, a, a margarita. Kind of a, a fizzy, salty. Yeah, yeah, I get I do get that. It does kind of smell like a a cherry mixed drink. Not so sure about the coconut, but that's okay. It's coconut, you know. Okay, booberry. I have just decided that I am liking cereal scents. Cereal scents throw so well for me. Um, Fruit Loops, um, Fruity Pebbles, yeah, and this is kind of a blue, blueberry, blue raspberry kind of cereal note. Mm, okay, I like this. I'm excited to warm that. And I think I got a blend with blueberry in it as well. Oh, I didn't do my sample, guys. Uh, State Fair kettle corn. Brown sugar, pecans, caramel, sweet and salty kettle corn. Yeah, this is warm. Uh, the pecans and the brown sugar is what stand out for me, which I'm not mad at. I love pecans and wax. I love nutty wax. Nutty wax. Okay. I really thought, oh, there it is. Okay. 
So I grab Cherry Berry Punch. See, I got some stuff that is just so not what you would think I would buy. Okay, this is a Cherry Heavy Fruit Punch. Yeah, this smells really good. I do like Fruit Punch and Wax, so that is good. I like that. Cereal killer. I do think I have another bag of this. I don't know. Mm, okay, this is like um, Fruity Pebbles. This has, does this have the sweet milk in it or cereal killer? Like a, because I love, I love sweet milk in wax. I don't get the sour note. If I do, I, I like it. Yeah, this is super good. I really like this one. Kind of fruity pebbles and milk. Uh, okay. I'm not real sure why I grabbed this. I think it's because she has a Cupcakes at Tiffany's and Peppermint Blend that I've ordered. I also, in the pre-order, ordered Cupcakes at Tiffany's Strawberries and Peppermint. So, I got a bag of just plain peppermint. And yeah, this is really strong, just plain peppermint. But I've got some ideas. Yeah, woo! Nose clearing, it's good. Nice peppermint. Then I grabbed Pumpkin Apple Bath and Body Works Type. I do have a couple pumpkin apple uh, Bath and Body Works candles. It has never been a powerhouse performer for me. It smells great, don't get me wrong. I love the smell. I just don't get a whole lot from it. So I thought um, if I could get some wax, which there's a lot of wax out there that goes with that candle. But anyway, she had it, why not, right? Yeah, and this is, Pumpkin apple, it's fall. I mean, it smells like pumpkin and cider almost. I kind of get that cidery note from this with the pumpkin. It's good. It smells like fall and I cannot wait. Um, okay, eggnog. I love eggnog in wax. I just love it. And this is good. Oh yeah, this is so creamy. A little, it does have a little bit of a sour note, but I love that. I think that's, I think that note I'm picking up on is what a lot of people don't like in like sugar milk and sweet milk in wax and cheesecake in wax. Oh yeah, I really like this. There's a little bit of a spice in eggnog too. This isn't overly spicy. I have had some eggnog wax that had a lot of like nutmeg in it and made it a little too much. This is not the way. This is so creamy and custardy. Okay, one more single and then the other three are blends. Blackberry. She has a really good blackberry. Yeah. I really like her blackberry. Blackberry has a tendency to turn body care-esque also. Um, I think you could make this do whatever you want. I don't know. I think I could put this with bakery and it would smell like bakery blackberry. I think I could put this with like more of like a vanilla lace or um, I don't know what else. Actually, I love blackberry and leather mixed together. I think I could do that and this would do great. I also have like some chlorine and some swimming pool wax that I think this would be great with that I do like to mix fruit with. So yeah, I think I could do anything with this. Bakery or whatnot. Okay, Boo Spooky Castle, Booberry Vanilla Crunch Donuts and Monster Cookie. That smells, I love the booberry. I really do. It smell. Um, a 
Okay, these are really similar. The plain blueberry and the blueberry spooky castle. This is a little bit more sharp in the blueberry because you don't have the bakery, you know, taming it down a little bit. Both are really, really good. Uh, Koopa Claus is coming to town plus Petey Colada. So we have lemon poppy seed cake, marshmallow smoothie, pina colada, royal sugar cookies, Gilligan's boot, brew, and baked zucchini bread. So we have those two together. I think the Petey Colada is the lemon, the marshmallow, and the pina colada. Koopa Claus is coming to town with zucchini bread, Gilligan's brew. Hell, I don't know. I don't really know, but... Either way, it's all those notes just mixed together. Uh, at first sniff, I got lemon. Don't get a lot of zucchini bread in this. Sorry, had to stop. I got a work call right in the middle of talking about Koopa Claus is coming to town and Petey Colada. So I can't even really remember where I was. Um, this smells like lemon and pina colada to me. I don't get much, um, I look like I was drinking it, didn't I? I don't get, I really don't get a lot of zucchini bread on this. The lemon really takes over, but I do get the pina colada. I mean, it's nice. I like it. I think you just get so used to zucchini bread taking over everything. And the last one is Starbeans Cafe and Poochie's Pup Pops. So you have vanilla cake pops, peanut butter, graham crackers, pretzels, espresso, vanilla crunch donuts, and vanilla bean Noel. Love me some coffee. Hmm. Oh. Yeah. Um, this is a nice coffee. This, this smells like it would be great to drink, actually. I get the peanut butter and the espresso. And then I get a vanilla bakery. Yeah, this is really good. I'm gonna enjoy melting this one very much. So that is my Rose Girls order. Um, hopefully I get my other orders done for you tonight so I can get those videos put up. So everyone, thanks for stopping by.